This is Ethiopia. Using advanced satellite imaging, we can observe what the agricultural harvest was and how it completely transformed the place in just one month, from October to November. We live in an age where artificial intelligence is increasingly being deployed to interpret satellite imaging, but the methods deployed are still in their infancy and very costly. What if we could develop a system that acts as a catalyst to enhance these methods that at the same time helps to tackle some of our greatest societal challenges? Enter Crowds and Machines, a new project that uses satellite information in a unique way to support the development of more effective interventions to mitigate the negative impacts of events that can be observed and monitored from space. One starting point, Cerberus. Cerberus is an advanced gaming platform that uses crowdsourcing to interpret satellite imaging. It currently utilizes the eyes of over 75,000 people to build advanced mapping products. The output? Detailed maps that are better than Google. How? Using trained players, the generated data is used to train AI and machine learning systems that can detect pre-identified objects and scale the original maps to much larger surface areas. Crowds and Machines shows us how collaboration between man and machine can be used for good. Using the crowdsourcing tools of Cerberus and the passion for gaming of people around the world, together with the latest machine learning techniques, we mapped, monitored and measured the rate of production of cereals and other crops in Ethiopia and Italy in the period 2016 to 2021. Our aim? to observe whether the COVID-19 pandemic impacted yields and harvesting potential under varying climate conditions and enhance our understanding of the causal pathways between food security and political stability. Ultimately, the method can be used to complement ongoing fieldwork that is often costly, time-consuming and reliant on fragmented information. Moreover, since the data can be collected, interpreted and scaled remotely, it can be applied in regions that are far removed, difficult to reach, or dangerous to enter. This is a project created in collaboration with Blackshaw, 52 Impact, and the Hague Center for Strategic Studies, and is supported by the European Space Agency. For more information, and to learn more about this golden alliance between man and machine, check out Blackshaw's Cerberus and the HCSS website.